get ready with me I'm gonna be getting ready to go nowhere I'm so sorry that I've been gone for so long and I haven't been filming or uploading or anything in forever because I've been so busy with school with my life and work and yeah like I have no ex those are my excuses I don't think they're valid but those are my excuses so today I'm just gonna be doing a get ready like obviously and for all my guys subscribers who don't know what a get ready with me is, is basically when a girl sits in front of her camera and really just gets ready to go out, which I am going to do. But yeah, so that's a quick little update. So now let's just get into the video. I don't know if it's this way or this way. I'm gonna go that way. I'm gonna be starting off by applying lotion onto my face. This is a lotion that I use, the Vaseline Intensive Care Dry Skin Repair. And to be honest, this is the lotion that I use every day. Like after I come out of the shower, take a bath, this is the lotion that I apply to my body. And it says that it's supposed to be for dry skin and it's supposed to repair skin or whatever, but I feel like this lotion makes me more drier than it's supposed to. Like, I don't think it helps me at all. And that kind of makes me really depressed. Also, fun fact. I always do my hair first before I do my makeup, but today it's gonna, I'm gonna do it the other way around because I don't know if I wanna curl or straighten my hair and I know that I don't wanna put heat onto my hair. So I'm just like, eh, I'll do my makeup first and then I'll see how, how I look and then I'll debate debate if I wanna do my makeup or not. I mean, do my hair or not. So first things first, I always, cause I'm doing like, I don't usually wear a lot of makeup, but when I do, I kinda go all out. So right now, I'm gonna do my eyeshadow because I always do my eyeshadow first. And I'm wearing a white shirt, so I'm gonna do a brown eye, brown eye. So I'm just gonna get my palettes out. I have three palettes. These palettes are amazing. Like I literally, when I first got my Costco paycheck, like when I literally got paid for the first time, I friggin' went off and like I, I fucked it up. Guys, that's my slogan, fuck it up. I use that slogan every single day. Everyone makes fun of me for it, but I don't care. So, mm -hmm. I'm gonna start with the Anastasia Soft Glam Palette. It's dirty, I know, it's velvet, it gets dirty, it's not my fault. But I'm gonna start off with the color, there's a lot of colors in here. Oh look, you can see me, huh, how cute. Yeah, this is how I film my YouTube videos, on my phone. But anyways, I'm gonna start off with Rustic, that one. And I'm really just gonna apply that all over my eyelids with this fluffy brush that I got from Walmart that I've been using since grade eight for, well not this exact brush since grade eight because that's gross, but you know, the same brand. So I just top, top. I just tap off the excess and I just literally just toss this color onto my eyelid. And like obviously it doesn't have to be perfect because it's just the base color. So you could just do this however way you want it. There's no specific way of literally putting on eyeshadow. Well, I don't really think there's a specific way of putting on eyeshadow. But again, everyone's different. So the next shade I'm gonna take is Cypher? Cypress Umber? I'm probably saying these names wrong, but I'm using that color. And I'm gonna put in the outer V of my eyeballs. So I'm literally gonna put it in, in here. And I'm just gonna blend this girl out. Ooh, pretty. And then I'm gonna take my concealer, and this is from NYX. It's the HD Studio Photogenic Powder con Powder Concealer. It's in the shade CW07. 
And I'm gonna take this and kind of cut out my crease. Pat this color on my crease. I stop midway, so I like to go almost to the end of my eye, but not to the very end, so that you still have that. And like when you when you cut your crease. It doesn't really matter if it's harsh because you're going to end up blending it with eyeshadow anyways. So I kind of just wing it. So I'm going to take this color called Summer, which is this color right here. And I'm going to take this shimmery color and literally just pack it onto my eyelids. Like literally where I put concealer on it, I'm just going to toss this on here. And like there's, it's okay if there's fallout because obviously you didn't do your full face yet. So if there is fallout, it's all okay because you're going to blend it out anyways. Yeah, I literally just I this is literally what I do because I put on concealer so I just drag this on the concealer and then I'm gonna take this Anastasia palette um, brush and I'm gonna go back into my soft glam palette and then I'm gonna take the color rustic again and I'm just gonna blend this palette summer and the Kyra Chris, I don't know, that really dark brown color that I had and I'm just gonna blend these two together to make it look nicer and to prevent any harsh lines. So that's what I'm gonna do. So now that I blended out most of my eyelids, I go back in with the same dark color and I just literally go into my corner again and literally darken it. So now that I'm done with my eyeshadow, I'm gonna go in with my eyeliner. And oh my gosh, I hate explaining it to people because it's so hard. I literally just start off with the outer corner. No, not the outer corner. The V, and I kind of just like it's. I'll show you guys instead of explaining it because it's easier to ex show you than to explain to you what I do. I really hope I don't fuck up. Now that I'm done my face, I'm gonna take this concealer, the same concealer, and I'm literally gonna conceal my entire face. So I'm gonna start off with underneath here, underneath the other eye. I'm also gonna go in with this Essence, the Cushion Eyeliner, and I'm gonna fill in my brows while I let the foundation, not the foundation, the concealer sit on my eyes. And I'm really just gonna brush this through. And I'm gonna take my beauty blender and start blending out everything. I use a mirror so I don't fuck up. And then I'm gonna use my new look dewy smooth Maybelline concealer in foundation, not concealer, in foundation in in 330 which is toffee and whoa, that's so much. I literally take this much, that's all I take. And I really dab it onto my face. Set my face with the 330, same foundation. The same powder that matches my foundation. So I'm literally just gonna take this and then put it all over my face, set everything. And then I'm gonna use this. Well, I'm gonna use my NYX contouring palette and I literally use, I need to get a new one. I use all the colors. This is how I contour my face. I literally use all the colors and I go, let me do my lipstick. So I'm gonna use the NYX lip liner in vintage. This is what it looks like, it's number 12. And I'm just gonna line my lips. After I'm done that, I'm going to take my Essence Matte Matte Zero 3 lipstick and I'm literally just going to put this all over my lips. Just twice. And then to get it to be super, super matte, I'm going to take the NYX um, Soft Matte Lip Cream in 
Rome and I'm just gonna put this all over my lips as well. So this is the finished makeup look. I'm going to do my hair and I will be right back. So I will be right back. So I'm gonna straighten my hair and this is my cur straightener, I was gonna say curler. This is my curler, it's called One Styler. I got it for 60 bucks at Trade Secrets and I literally got it in 10 minutes. I walked into the store, I needed a straightener. I grabbed the first one and I left out hot. So I'm gonna straighten my hair and then yeah. So I'm back and this is the end of my video. So I straightened my hair, I put on some earrings, I put on some jewelry. But yeah, this is my everyday makeup routine. I straightened my hair because I was too lazy to curl it. And actually I didn't even know where my curler was, so I just straightened my hair. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Turn on the notification bell so you guys are notified whenever I'm posting. Um. I love you guys all so much and I really appreciate it if you guys commented down below any videos or anything that you guys want to see me do next. I will leave all my products down below, like everything I use for my face, my curling wand, my, not my curling wand, my straightener and everything in the down below below. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, this go. Yeah, and all that fun stuff. And I love you guys so much. Thank you all for watching. Mwah!